What though, really? I need the shower. Charlie Sheen took to Twitter and asked his followers to go to his daughter's school and throw dog shit at it because she was being bullied. If I had to make a list of things you should never do, number one would probably be throw dog shit at a school, uh, but a very close second would be listen to Charlie Sheen. As of April 22nd, McDonald's is going to start offering its Egg McMuffin with just egg whites, calling it the Egg White Delight, and it's 50 calories lighter than just the regular old Egg McMuffin. Is that worth it? I don't know, you tell me. Do you know what you have to do to burn 50 calories? Conduct a fake orchestra for 14 minutes. I'm sorry, is that too much work? Okay, then you can just type an email for 20 minutes. And if both of those are too much work for you, then you can just laugh for 10 to 15 minutes, which ironically is what the people behind you in line at McDonald's at breakfast time are gonna do when you try to order something diety. Then they're gonna get the regular Egg McMuffin and it will all be evened out. You guys, Justin Bieber's pet hamster Pack died. Considering it's spelled like this, P-A-C, I'm assuming he wants us to say Pac because it's probably an homage to Tupac, but no, Justin, I won't do that to Tupac because he's alive somewhere and he could be listening. What upsets me more than the fact that his hamster died though is the fact that this situation is still happening. Are you guys seeing this or am I crazy? That hat is not on your head, it's just floating above it. What are you doing? Stop doing it, please. Rixie's so mad. <laughs> care if you don't like my dance moves, okay? They're not here to impress you. They're not here to make you go, whoa, she's good at dancing. So suck it. For anyone who's new here to the speed round, hi, welcome, how are you? Every Friday we do something called viewer email, which is when you send me questions either in my email or on my Facebook or on my Twitter, and I answer them. Yes, for those of you who like to continue to make this point, I don't usually use emails anymore, but that's because if you could see what comes to my inbox, you wouldn't either. Plus, what am I going to call it? Viewer Social Media Friday? Oh, cool, guys. Cool name. It's got a nice ring to it. <laughs> Let's answer some questions. If you were voted Pope, what name would you take? Hmm. Do you get to pick it yourself, or do they pick it for you? I don't know how that works. Okay, if I were Pope, I would be Pope... Paris. Pope Paris. Because this smells good. And old people would like me, and I would basically just sit on a coffee table and, and not do much. Earlier in the week, you had a story on Topanga. Who was your teenage heartthrob crush growing up? All right, from Boy Meets World, Ryder Strong. Mmm, he was my boo-boo. Everybody liked Devin Sawa. He did not do it for me. Uh, JTT, I was a big fan of Jonathan Taylor Thomas. When it came to the boy bands, in sync, I liked JC, but that's because I was a contrarian and I knew that all the girls liked Justin Timberlake. And I wasn't, you know, I was a realist about where I was at looks-wise back then. And I knew that if we ever had the opportunity, me and my friends, to meet in sync, everyone would go for JT. I wouldn't be able to win that battle, so I would just take the next best thing. And he had a nice little voice. Best TV show theme song ever. I say Fresh Prince, but you may beg to differ. First of all, I don't beg for shit. Second of all, um, Fresh Prince, obviously, is probably the best ever, but we could talk about other ones I liked. Uh, step by Step. Step by step, day by day by day. She got sassy with it. What is the best way to a woman's heart? I'd be good at oral sex. <laughs> Sorry, Mom. Uh, if that doesn't work, just buy a scalpel. Your opinion on steak and BJ day? What, you mean like Wednesdays? What's your favorite rap quote slash lyric? That's a really difficult question. This is gonna piss some people off, but most of my favorite rap lyrics and quotes come from Childish Gambino, AKA Donald Glover, and I know that it's because he's a comedian and he's also a rapper. And I know he gets a lot of shit because he's not like a great rapper, but I completely disagree. And sure, my opinion means absolutely nothing, but he puts a lot of like thought into the things he says. Like, I'm heading west like I'm fucking blowing Kanye. That's awesome. In the back of a bush, like Gavin Rossdale's drummer. That's awesome. You can ask Gremlin because every time I make her listen to one of his songs, I just keep pausing it and I'm like, did you hear that? Did you hear what he just said? What is the last number of pi? 11D7. 
I don't know, you guys watch Big Bang Theory, not me. Tacos or burritos and what's in it? I love your question, I love it. Um, burritos. It depends on, on the day, but oh, like in life in general, burritos. What's in it? Here it goes. Uh, carne asada, sour cream, guacamole, tons of cheese, rice, refried beans, I think that's everything, no vegetables or any of that shit, and then french fries. It will change your life. Best trilogy, Star Wars, Lord of the Rings, Other. Those are good. Um, Mighty Ducks. If Kevin Conley were to die, how would you celebrate? All right, a little harsh, okay? It's playful and lighthearted and fun. You don't want your arch enemy to die. Then I have no one to work against, right? There's no point to my quest. Like, why do you think villains never killed the good guys? Because they would have nothing to live for. It's like a deep psychological background to the question that you're asking. We could get into it if you want to, I just don't have that much time left in this video. Okay, that's gonna do it for your speed round, guys. If you enjoyed this video, please click the like button, share it with your friends, subscribe to our channel, and be sure to leave a comment down below letting me know which part made you laugh the loudest, or if I answered your question, if I did an okay job, or if I sucked at it. You can be honest, I'm brutally honest with you. Uh, and if you haven't left yet today, there'll be a link in the description to a video that'll make you do so. Enjoy your Fridays and your Saturdays and your friggin' St. Patrick's days. And I will see you all on Monday. That's gonna suck. Uh, with more headlines that you need to know. Bye. Is it milk and cookies or cookies and milk? It's nom 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 because you don't have time to answer because I'm too busy putting those two things into my mouth. Oh my God, guys! Click on 155. She says putting two things in my mouth. Stop doing that shit.